Right, Coach, uh, last week you guys were at the Harold Funston Invitational. Uh, what are your thoughts on how well your team did? Well, I was really impressed with, with how they um, accepted me as their new coach and, and were able to trust me pretty much right away. Mm -hmm. uh, so I thought we improved with each round, and that's a good sign. Uh, and I think that you know, as we continue through the year, we'll just see more and more improvement. Maybe not in the score as much, but in the actual uh, competitive situations and how they respond to them. And what were they doing so well? I mean, through each round, it seemed like their their, their scores kept getting lower. Uh, what were they doing so well in, in those adjustments that they made? Well, playing the same golf course virtually uh, in the 36 hole day. So they, they learned a lot in the morning round and they, uh, you know, were able to to make a different uh, strategy, some changes in their strategy and their game plan. And so I think that helped. Um, they got the speed of the green, so that helped. And then the third round, the next day, obviously they know the golf course better. And so they were they were just feeding off of each other's excitement too, that they were just starting to play well. And you could see that. Uh, this coming week, you guys head up to uh, Arkansas for the uh, Red Wolves Classic. That's such a quick turnaround. What do you guys have to focus on heading to that tournament? Well, I think, again, just uh, their mental game and their short game. So we've been working a lot on their mental toughness, uh, working a lot on their short game and, and learning new shots around the green and the appropriate shots to use. So nobody's seen the golf course before. I haven't seen it. They haven't seen it. So we'll have to learn it um, in the practice round and really develop some strategies so that they can continue to have the opportunity to learn. Now, one quick question. Last week, um, Melissa, she tied the second lowest single round score in program history. How does she continue to get better and did her teammates follow suit behind her? Yeah, I think so. I mean, she's definitely a team leader uh, on the golf course and she, um, you know, she has a lot of game and a lot of fire and a lot of commitment. And she, she also really understands how to, to play the game. She, she knows, you know, and the strategies and when to take risks and when not to take risks. So I think that all that, if they'll watch her and learn from her, um, you know, they can definitely learn a lot from the way she goes about uh, strategizing to play a, a golf course.